folks, how we doing? We're gonna do our top 10 tractor attachments of 2022 today. Plus, we got some surprises, some predictions, and the top five discount club members too. Before we get started, we had a prediction last year. I was guessing, a bit of a premonition, that the land plane would crack the top 10 for this year's list. So now's the time to see if I was right. Okay, I'm going from 10 to one, gonna rank it by number of units sold, all right? So number 10, the tiller, rototiller. You might hear it called a couple different things. Could be forward or reverse rotation. We've sold every single one is actually, can be either one, forward or reverse rotation. A lot of folks probably don't know that, but a rototiller is excellent, of course, for prepping for a garden, if you wanna do some landscaping and get a new yard put in or take out all the bumps in the hills of a field, just kill everything off, start over from scratch. It's really hard to beat a tiller. They also work really well. We've used them for driveway preparation. You wanna get some of that top soil out of there, run over it with a tiller once or twice, makes that top soil very loose, nice to reuse it somewhere else, takes up all the sod, chops it up, a good use for it. Before I forget everything we see on this list today, we can help you out with goodworkstractors.com. We sell and ship all over the country. Okay, number nine, the core plug aerator. These are very popular. You know, we have a really good source now with Dirt Dog where they make an affordable four foot, five foot, and six foot version. Great for the normal residential application. You know, we actually have some folks using these as part of their landscape service portfolio. A really quick payback that way too. And like pretty much everything else on this list, we've done a video all about it. So check that out if you want to learn more. Number eight was only in this position because we had a limited number of units that we could get. If we could have gotten more, we would have sold more, most certainly. But the flail mower continues to grow in popularity every year with good reason. It's very compact, just leaves a cleaner finish compared to a brush hog, does an excellent job. The ability to offset and get outside of your tires. If you want to cut underneath a brush line uh, on a fence row, maybe even into a ditch, a flail mower can do that where a brush hog really can't. We sell a variety of Del Marino flail mowers. There's a series to fit your machine no matter what you have. Number seven, pallet forks, and these come in all shapes and sizes but it's one of the main reasons I say make sure you have a quick attach on your bucket. If you have a John Deere well you're basically guaranteed to have the JDQA unless you have a utility tractor you may have something else. For everything else make sure you're getting the skid steer quick attach. You'll see some of the oh Yanmar has their own quick attach, LS has their own quick attach. There's a couple other goofy ones out there. I'm telling you get one of the standard systems, either JDQA or SSQA, you're doing yourself a favor. You can get forks among all sorts of other attachments, but it's no surprise to see this staple on the list. Next up, my very own Versa Bracket. And so the Versa Bracket is a, well, multi-function tool. It's first and foremost, it's gonna be a weight bracket so you can hang suitcase weights on there. Ballast weight is very important here. Every tractor needs it, so that's the biggest function, but we've added more to that. It has a two inch receiver built in. It's got a pair of chain hooks on it. It's got a, well, we, we started out calling it a chainsaw holder, which it still is, but it's also a big flat shelf. So you can put uh, a toolbox on there or you can repurpose it to use it for whatever you want. So if you already have suitcase weights, we sell the Versa Bracket as a standalone item. If you wanna get the full package with the weights as well, we sell that too. Before we get to the top five, let's go through the honorable mention really quick. These almost made the cut, very close, right on the cusp. But we have the brush hog, which took a back seat to the flail mower and continues to every year. Still a good option, considerably cheaper. And then we have our grading tools, kind of mixed in together, the box blades, the land planes, and the rakes. If we lump them all together, they would certainly be on this list, but as standalone items, they're not quite there. And for you keen listeners, that means I was wrong. The land plane did not make the list this year. Okay, number five this year was the CMP dethatcher. We carry the 60 inch dethatcher. It's a multi-purpose rake, one of the cheaper tractor tools that you can buy out there. Ships UPS ground, comes in oh five foot long box, only nine inch by nine inch wide. Takes about an hour to put together. Great for dethatching as the name might suggest, but that's good for scarifying to overseed in the fall or in the spring or a new landscaping job. If you have some final cleanup to do at a new residential construction or a remodel, fantastic for that. Some light driveway grading, leaf cleanup, the list just goes on and on. Hooks right up to your category one three-point hitch and is quick hitch compatible too. Okay, number four gives us our surprise entry on the list this year. And in fact, I don't even know if this time last year I had a even an inkling that this could happen. But early this year, Chris and I bought Rhino Hide Canopies. And so while that is technically a different company from Good Works Tractors, it's still kind of all rolled together in the same thing. So Rhino Hide Canopies takes the fourth spot this year as the fourth most popular item. 
There's a solution for just about every compact tractor out there. The Rhino Hide Canopy is lightweight, nearly indestructible, and easily removable for transportation and storage. Okay, number three on this year's list, the HLA Snow Pusher. Again, a variety of shapes and sizes. Another reason you want a quick attach on your loader. Swap out from that bucket to a snow pusher, to forks, to a grapple, and so on. Makes life so easy. I think, speaking on behalf of all the customers that buy these, the reason a snow pusher is so popular is because you don't have to take your whole loader off, right? It gives you that versatility to switch back and forth. Plus, a snow pusher is simple. There's no moving parts. There's no hydraulics. There's no electronic anything. It's just easy. Less to go wrong when you're out there in the middle of winter and the cold and the blowing snow and everything else. Plus it's good for a variety of conditions. It can be wet, heavy snow, light, fluffy snow, just an inch or two for cleanup, a foot or more to clear it out of the way. Number two on this year's list is another one of my own creations. Not that it's the only one on the market. I think I just make the best one. And it's the GWT Stump Wrecker. We now have a mini version and an HD version available. Yet another tool proving the usefulness of a quick attach on your loader. You take your regular bucket off, you put this mini shovel, this poor man's backhoe, whatever you want to call it right on there, gives you just a concentrated digging force, a, a digging point there on your loader to, to pop stumps out, to pop boulders out, to dig a trench, to plant for trees, to pop out old landscaping, all sorts of uses for it. Available in John Deere Quick Attach and Skid Steer Quick Attach too. Before we get to number one, really quick, my prediction for next year, I think, I think I'm going to be right on this. I don't know where it's going to land, but somewhere on there is going to be our latest creation, which is the GWT Hitch Hanger, all right? And so this mounts to a quick hitch. It could be the Spico Quick Hitch or a similarly sized uh, Quick Hitch, the Harbor Freight one, for example. We also have the John Deere iMatch Hitch Hangers, so a version for each one. You can hang up to six suitcase weights on there, get an extra up to 450 pounds of ballast weight on the backside of your tractor. Again, you kind of see a theme here. We're really big on that, that safety, tractor safety and counterweight. And so this is another solution to help out with that. I think it's gonna make it next year. Folks, I wanna take just a second to tell you about our channel sponsor, RimGuard. They are a liquid ballast solution. They line up with exactly what we do here on Good Works, which is talking about tractors and tractor safety. We see it as simple as this. If you own a tractor, you need RimGuard. In fact, some tractors include RimGuard as standard out of the factory. Liquid ballast is simply weight, all right? And this weight hides inside your tires. It stays there all the time. It's a safety concern because tractors are almost always too light and too tippy out of the factory. The number one attachment used by every tractor owner is their front end loader. So when you pick up something heavy on the front end, your back end wants to pick up off the ground. RimGuard liquid ballast helps keep your back end planted to the ground. But beyond safety, it's gonna help maintain traction because if those rear tires, those power driving tires are on the ground, you have traction to go where you need to. And you're gonna operate more efficiently because if those rear tires aren't on the ground, you're not gonna pick up as much as you need to or take it where you need to go. RimGuard is all natural. That means it's safe. It is the heaviest per gallon, all natural product on the market. It's not gonna freeze, it's not gonna corrode, and it's available at over a thousand dealers nationwide. To find a dealer, visit RimGuardSolutions.com to make your tractor safer today. And number one this year, for the second year in a row, and I don't think it's going anywhere anytime soon, is gonna be the Spico E-Hitch Quick Hitch, all right? For category one tractors, a tractor like this, a 1025, a BX, all the way up to a tractor as big as a John Deere 4066R, a Kubota L6060, and even some of the smaller utility tractors. I've got a Kubota M4D071. It uses that. If you have a tractor that's Cat 1, and Cat 2 compatible, then a Cat 1 Quick Hitch will fit on there. Check it out, this version does not use any bushings at all, okay? So the bushings really add up on cost if you get them for all of your attachments. Not to mention, we just did a video recently showing how it's $100 cheaper than a John Deere iMatch. All right, now time for our top five discount club partners that we work with, and again, these are companies that you go right to their website, you buy from them, but you use code GWT, you save at least 5%, sometimes more off of your order. Now in no particular order, starting with the Tractor PTO link, okay? Okay, tractorptolink.com. Their solution makes life easier connecting your PTO shaft to your tractor. It can be a real pain. This moves it out into an easier to use location. A lot of times the PTO shaft is just kind of, well, it's, it's either corroded or it's got dirt on there. It doesn't want to slide on and off very easy. So this eliminates that pain. It's no surprise that they're on the list. 511 Grill Guards. We just had Justin back out for another video. Time and time again, we have so much positive feedback about his grill guards, how well built they are, the fit of them, the finish of them. Not only do they look good, but they serve a functional purpose to protect the front end of your tractor. So if you're doing grapple work, other kind of nasty condition type work, a grill guard can really save your tractor. JU Fabworks, 
has bolt on brackets for virtually every bucket that's out there these days. They've got a universal design. If you don't have one that'll fit with the John Deere or the Kubota buckets, these allow you to have tie down points, uh, points to strap to to hold things in your bucket, points to drag material from. Very easy to install, relatively cheap, a pretty good Christmas present too. Summit Hydraulics, no, not not Summit Tractors, not to be confused, separate company. Summit Hydraulics makes DIY solutions for your tractor. So if you don't have a third function on your tractor up front, or you want more remotes on the back of your tractor, going to a dealer is a really expensive option. It can be done, but you can do it yourself in a couple hours time and save a whole lot of loot. And last but not least is gonna be Loop Shuttle. These guys have an excellent, just superior greasing system in every way. Takes the pain out of greasing. They've got a manual pistol style and they've got an electric style grease gun as well. You can swap cartridges, they're recyclable, they're reusable. You're not gonna have the leak down that you have and a mess on your floor to deal with, so Lube Shuttle, check them out. That's a wrap for us, folks. If you thought something else should have made this list, I'd love to hear about it. If you've got a product that you think everybody would love, I wanna know about that too. If you're looking for something on this list, you can find everything at goodworkstractors.com. I'd love to have you follow along, so hit that subscribe button right down below. I wanna thank you for taking time out of your day to stop by, and until next time, stay safe. We'll see you soon. Yeah.